Greetings everyone, it's my third video debunking this uh, yeah. global earth agenda. So um, there'll probably be more, a few more of these videos because I have a few more tricks up my sleeve, yeah. Um, this image here we're looking at is the image. It says here, various satellites and aircraft have taken the blue marble style photos. This one notable in 2012 from the VIIRS Infrared Imager Radio Meter Suite instrument aboard the Suomi NPP, NASA's Earth Ob uh, observ Observing Satellite, Observation Satellite. Anyway, you'll notice how large North America is here. It's, it's trickling down into South America. I, I mean, this is huge. This is massive. Look at the size of Mexico, the Mexico, um, you know what I mean, this here from the panhandle over to, to uh, Mexico here. It, I mean, North America is huge. So, I mean, the quickest way for me to debunk this ridiculous image is just go uh, Earth. Okay, oh, so hopefully you can see that. Uh, Earth, or sorry, um, the United States, 9.8 million square kilometers pretty pretty straightforward the Pacific Ocean 165 million square kilometers so quite a big quite a bit larger than the United States wouldn't you say so I mean even just being 10 times larger we're looking at 16 times the size of the United States agreed simple math so you're telling me the Pacific Ocean is going to wrap around the corner from here all the way around 16 times around this little red blue dot here come on guys think about it the United States takes up half of the globe here okay from here to about here which is about half I don't even care if it's one third it should only be a tenth tenth the size one sixteenth the size of the Pacific Ocean all right other in other news this here this is called a lettuce spinner you know how it works look you turn the handle here and it spins on its own okay throwing the water off the lettuce so just imagine this is earth going a thousand miles a minute what happens on the outer edge of here, over here? Well, the atmosphere is so thin that, um, you know, with gravity, it uh, sticks to, this, to the earth, to the surface of the earth because of gravity. Well, if this is a vacuum here and this is a really light layer of air, it's going to get sucked out into space. In fact, the whole earth should implode. All right, come on, guys. Use your head, please. And enough with the stupid mathematics. Obviously, this isn't to scale. As usual, you guys are going to call me on that. It would be nice to have a few nice comments on there. So, anyway. Yo, check it out. Have a good day. Wars flat. Peace out.